when Buddha was being tormented by the demon Mara, he invited Mara in for tea. And Mara can represent many things, but for the sake of conversation today, let's have Mara represent alternative ideas, opposing ideas, ideas that we have demonized, that have become the demons of opposing ideas. And what I would suggest is to invite those ideas in, invite those demons in, sit with them, have tea with them, get to know them, make friends with them, see what they have to say, what they have to present, what is good about them, what is bad about them. And the reason for this is knowledge is power. So the, the demon, the opposing idea, the um, opposing side, the other people, whatever it may be, they know you. They are getting to know you. And since knowledge is power, their knowledge of you and your lack of knowledge or your feigned knowledge of them puts you in a weaker position. So equalize that power. Get to know them just as they are getting to know you. When something is demonized, when something is unknown, when something is in the shadows, it is hidden, it's something that causes fear within us. And that fear makes us easier to control. So as opposed to fearing another idea, learn about it. Learn so much about that opposing idea that you make it afraid of you. That people with opposing ideas don't want to present their ideas to you or that might be a bad way to put it. They may be intimidated by you because they know you have such knowledge of both your idea and their idea. And this must be true knowledge of the idea. This must be why does this idea exist? Why do people think this way? Not why do I think they think this way? Not how can I straw man them to say why they think this way, but why do they truly think this way? What is the power behind this idea? What makes it good? Because when you truly understand it, when you've truly learned it, then you have power over that idea. When you silence or you hide an idea, you give it power. You put it into the shadows where it is a scary thing. You let it sit and hide in those shadows and observe you while you are forgetting that it exists. It is gaining power. And so you are giving it power by trying to silence it or hide it or pretend it doesn't exist or get this false sense of understanding about it rather than true knowledge of it. These are all things that give it more power over you. Then you become more afraid of that idea. Then that idea gains more power over you. So invite that demon in, that demon of an opposing view, that demon of something you don't like. Get to know it. Maybe you'll make a friend. Maybe if your idea is superior, you can bring that demon into the light. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I, of course, love hearing from you. Go ahead and hit the like button and share this if you were so inclined. Have a great day.